In this lesson, I want to show you how you can scale an image up or down, how to make it bigger than it is or smaller. We are going to start by making this chicken bigger than what it actually is. And for that, we'll access a property called scale and then a method set to. We can specify a different scale for the x and for the y axis. If I just enter one number, that same number will be applied to both x and y. So, for example, if I want to make the chicken twice as big um, on both X and Y, I would enter 2. And I'll make our chicken twice as big. The growth will occur from the anchor point. So, in this case, the center keeps on being... The anchor point will remain in the same position, and then that's from where it's going to grow. grow. Um, if I wanted to make it bigger on X, but uh, the same size on Y... I would put 1. 1 means that there's no scaling going on. So on Y, the chicken is just as big, but on X, it's twice as big. What if I want to make an image smaller? Let's create another sprite to test that. This.horse, this.game.add.sprite, that allows us to add a new sprite. Let's put it in position 120 and 10, and it's going to use the, the, um, the horse key. So that should show us a little horse there. If I want to make it smaller, then I'll use the scale property, but instead of entering a number larger than 1, remember that 1 is the, the, the existing, the, the normal size, I will enter a number smaller than 1. So, for example, if I want to make it half as big in both X and Y, I'll enter 0 0.5. And if I reload the page, you can see that now it's half the size. You can also notice that the anchor point is on the top left corner, so that's from where it was reduced. Take, I'm going to repeat that so you can see it again. Um, see how this point will remain at the same position. That's where it, where it grows or where it shrinks from. So that's how you can scale images up or down. It's very straightforward and very simple.